being an ambitious girl. You're just small time. Liberty City is in shock today as the police and emergency services deal with the aftermath of a devastating attack on a police convoy this morning. As yet, no details have been released about the prisoners being transferred in the convoy, and no group has claimed responsibility. The convoy left police headquarters early this morning for a routine transfer of felons to Liberty Penitentiary. The attack took place on the Callahan Bridge, leaving few witnesses and the bridge itself severely damaged. Some of the convicts are thought to have perished in the explosion that followed the initial attack. Revelations as to the professionalism of the attack struck police hours afterward when identification of the missing felons were further hampered by an attack by computer hackers on police headquarters databases. With the Porter Tunnel Project falling behind schedule, this disaster leaves Portland isolated from the rest of the city. Come on! Senor Dickhead! It's no problem to kill you. You gonna be sorry. Aye, aye, get lost. I know a place on the edge of the red light district where we can lay low, but my hands are all messed up, so you better drive, brother. This is Hit Radio, Love Media Station. Just one of 900 radio stations, 300 TV stations, four network, three satellites, ten senators. Thank you! Thank you! Head Thank radio. you! Thank you! Thank you. You're listening to Head Radio, the rock of Liberty City for 60 years. I'm DJ Michael Hunt taking you through another set of non-stop rock and pop. It's Head Radio. the danger clothes. Wait here. 
here, man, while I go in and talk to Luigi. got some business upstairs. Or maybe you could do me a favor. One of my girls needs a ride, so grab a car and pick up Misty from the clinic, then bring her back here. Remember, no one messes with my girls. So keep your hands on the wheel. If you don't mess this up, maybe there'll be more work for you. Now get out of here. So, here, here, take it. There's a new high on the street. Goes by the name of Spank. Some wise guy's been introducing this trash to my girls down Portland Harbor. Go and introduce a vat to his face. Then take his car, respray it. I want compensation for this insult. Whatever with good things.
friends say, Tony, do you remember the 70s and 80s? And I say, yeah. Well, I certainly don't remember anything since then. All night. Time for a commercial breakdown. You're listening to Flashback FM. I'm Tony, and I'll be right back where you left me. Do you live in the boring suburbs but dream of living in a lonely castle on a windswept moor? Do you long to trade in your sweatsuit for a hundred-pound suit of armor and swap your SUV for a noble stallion? Do you eat microwave dinners? All the while wishing you were roasting a suckling pig at a pagan banquet. Is your next ideal home improvement a boat? Well, get ready, Liberty City. This weekend and every weekend at Liberty City Park, it's the Medieval Millennium Fair. Our band of traveling minstrels, knights, and maidens oh so fair are ready to delight you with tales of the Black Death, witch burnings, and the joys of being a feudal sir. Forget about air conditioning and modern medicine. We've got all the leeches, spells, and potions you need at the Medieval Millennium Fair. Learn the art of cooking with turnips. Yum yum. Buy genuine reproduction medieval artifacts including maces, double-handed battle swords, and one size fits all chain mail. And this weekend only, pick up an authentic mechanical Lady of the Lake in Excalibur. It's perfect for your garden pond or swimming pool. And learn how to rid your condo of vermin using a penny whistle and a mysterious prancing German named Hans. The Medieval Millennium Fair. Every weekend at Liberty City Park. All the songs you were tired of 20 years ago. Flashback FM. Flashback FM. Uh.